There are six tips which helped me finish my AMC clinical examination preparation successfully in two and a half months. First of all, focus on structured learning. It helps to join the courses which can help you with this because this way you will save your time preparing and compiling the materials and focus more on your practice. Because in this exam, knowledge is important, but more important is how you use this knowledge. So you can get the knowledge from these preparation classes and you can use your extra time to prepare for the exam by doing the role plays and practices with your friends. Then use your resources well. When you read a case from the handbook, make your own summary notes. Now, those of you who do not know what handbook is, you have to know about this book. This is the only resource that the AMC has provided us. And this contains many useful pieces of information that can help you in preparing for the exam. You may need to read this book more than once. Make sure that you save important ideas from this book on your phone so you can use different note-taking applications for this. The reason for this is it makes it easier to access them whenever you need them or whenever you have free time. That's what I used to do. I used to read my notes when I would be watching my kids playing in the park. Early practice is very important. If you cannot join group role plays, you can practice all by yourself. That's what I had to do because of my circumstances. Record yourself explaining cases on your phone. This is a good way to check your process and improve how you speak under pressure. Use smart study strategies. Enki flashcards are very good for learning differential diagnosis. I use them a lot. This allows you to recall information fast during the examination. Also making mind maps helps to connect different concepts together, which I did for myself using Obsidian. And if you don't know how to do that, you can watch my other videos. Now on the exam day, have a clear plan. Look at the task first and structure your response based on what is asked. This keeps you organized. Make sure that you can finish all the tasks and do not waste your time just doing one of the tasks even in the exam. Finally, connect with your peers. It is very helpful to share resources and strategies with other candidates. Helping each other makes this difficult journey easier. And if you want to get this help, please join our Telegram group, the link for which I have shared in the comments. All the best for your exam.